Does anybody remember the AI-generated video of Will Smith eating spaghetti? Well, I certainly do. What's up, everybody? It's Verschmitty Warbin Jaegerman Jensen, and in today's video, we're gonna be talking a little bit about how exactly somebody would create an AI-generated video like this. So if you've ever seen a video on the internet, such as Will Smith eating spaghetti with his hands, that was clearly AI-generated, and you ever thought to yourself, hmm, how does one make a video like that? Then today's your lucky day because I'm going to be explaining to you just how they do that. And the way we're gonna be making our own AI-generated videos is through an app called Poyo.ai. Now what Poyo.ai does is it allows you to basically just drag an image into their website and then create a prompt for what you want the image to do, and then it will completely AI-generate a video off of that image for you. Or if you don't have an image, you could just literally write a prompt and then it'll still AI-generate a video for you. Now obviously you don't have to use Poyo.ai to make memes and memes only. It certainly helps though. But an actual practical use case for something like this would be is if, say, you are a business owner and you want to make promotional videos but don't really have the skills to edit it all together like that. Well, you could use Poyo.ai to AI generate you a video promoting your own business. So the possibilities with something like this are actually endless. But with that out of the way, ladies and gentlemen, sit back, relax, grab a cup of coffee, grab your spaghetti with your hands, and let's get right into it. So now that we're on our desktop, let's get started by opening up Chrome and going to Poyo.ai. As you can see, it's as simple as typing Poyo.ai in your web browser and boom, you're here. But now you have to sign in and I do have to let you know that you get two AI videos that you can create for completely free if you sign into this. Yep, you heard correctly, you could generate Will Smith eating spaghetti for absolutely free. But I'm actually already signed in, so let's just go and hit try Poyo AI. And you'll notice that it'll bring you to this sort of panel where there's a bunch of different options we have to generate our AI video. So for example, in the image to video tab, this is where you're going to take an image and then turn it into a video of your choosing. Same thing goes with the text to video tab. This is where you enter in a prompt and then it turns your text into a video. Now under the templates tab, you actually have a bunch of templates that'll automatically create a video based on whatever the template is that you're using. And of course you have the your creations tab where you get to view all of your AI generated videos. But it looks like I haven't created anything yet, so let's change that. Let's go to image to video and uh, as you'll see on my desktop, I have this lovely picture here of our boy Walter White, right? And now we want to recreate the Will Smith eating spaghetti video, but we're going to do it with Walter White because I think it will just be better. Now to do that, it's actually extremely simple. We're going to be following these steps, right? Watch and learn, boys. All you have to do is take your image of Walter White and put it in the website just like that. Now it'll let you crop it and adjust it to however you want, but I'm just going to hit OK because that's perfect right there. So now under the prompt side of things, we're going to say, uh, make this man eat spaghetti with his hands and if you scroll down you're gonna see a bunch more options right here as you can see it says prompt strength so uh, we can go on the more creative side of things or we could uh, follow the prompt exactly how I typed it so we're just gonna set this to hundred over here we're gonna follow that prompt exactly how I typed it and you can see you'll also be able to choose the length of your video there's five or ten seconds and I'm just gonna choose ten right quick and for our last option you can see we have a negative prompt option so for this we could list all the elements and effects that we don't want to see in the generator video. So for example, it'd be like cartoonish characters or dark colors or explosions or just stuff that we want filtered out of the AI generated video. But I think this is exactly the video that I was looking for. So I'm just going to go ahead and hit create. And you'll notice whenever you do hit create, it says over here that Poyo AI is generating your video and it may take two to five minutes to complete. So while that's generating, I'll get back to you as soon as it's done. And it looks like our video has been done generating. So let's just take a look and see the results of this. Oh my god. So as you can see, AI has obviously gotten a lot better with um, making people eat spaghetti as compared to the Will Smith video. <laughs> but there we have it. It's Walter White eating spaghetti. <laughs> So as you can see, this actually works really well. But back to what I said before at the beginning of the video, it doesn't have to be all memes with this, right? You don't have to just make a bunch of people eating spaghetti. So for example, if we go into the text to video tab over here, let's say I needed some stock footage for some of my YouTube videos, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm actually just going to type make me stock footage of a guy hacking. Actually, let's not say stock footage. Let's just say make me footage of a guy hacking, right? So I could just use this in the background of my videos, some dude probably like typing on a computer or something. Now we're gonna keep the aspect ratio at 16 by nine. Um, let's let's have it do a little bit more, more on the creative side this time, right? This is kind of a plain boring uh, description right here. This time we're gonna make it for five seconds and um, let's add some camera control, why not? Let's do a... Uh, 
Let's make it zoom in a bit. We'll make it zoom in. And we're gonna set the movement to 23. Now I'm just gonna hit create on this uh, stock footage and we're gonna see what it comes up with. And it looks like our video is done generating. So let's see what our new background footage is. Just gonna hit play. Look at that, he's got a light up keyboard and everything, man. It's a hacker. Although the words kind of look a little bit strange. You know what, maybe the hacker is on acid. You never know. Maybe this is what he's seeing right here. But either way, you could see exactly how this could be used for background videos or promotional videos for a business or anything that you really need. So moving on to the templates section, we're going to choose one of these templates, right? What should we do, handshake? You know what, I think we're gonna do the handshake one because I've got a perfect image for people that need to shake hands. So as you can see, it's the same as the image to video section where we're gonna take an image of two people this time and upload it just like that as you can see I have Walter and Jesse right here and we're gonna make them shake hands so now that that's done uploading we're just gonna hit create and I'll see you when the video is done generating all right so it looks like our video is done generating here let's see Walter and Jesse shake hands let's see what the ending of Breaking Bad should have been like all right we got what oh, Jesse whoa <laughs> Uh, it looks like Jesse just decided to hand Walter a beer here, and then their hands merged, and they became one. <laughs> so I don't think that was exactly supposed to happen, but I mean, it was kind of weird. I don't think I did it right, because they both had something in their hand. Uh, Walter took his hand off the beer, but Jesse just decided Walter should have two beers, I guess. Either way, I call that a success. I mean, they shook hands, as, as you can see clearly. But with that out of the way, let's go over to our creations tab, and what you could actually do with these creations is, say you wanted to use one, you can go over the three dots right here and all you have to do is click download and it will start downloading it to your computer. Well that about sums up the demonstration section everyone. As you can see this tool is pretty cool and can be used for so many different things but I'm gonna give my final thoughts about it as well as the conclusion and I'll see you over there. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that about does it for the video. If you want my full and honest opinion about this app, I think it's great. I think it's very easy to use. You know, a monkey could do it. I think there's a lot of awesome customizable options that you could do to generate a video with AI. And I think it's really cool that it's actually completely free and you get to generate your own AI videos for free. With that being said, make sure if you like this video, make sure to smash that like button. And if you want more content like this, make sure you hit that subscribe button as well. That being said, have a nice day. My name is Veraxity and stay safe on the internet. Peace.